Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Rose for anybody that is new. Um, hi, welcome. Please hit that subscribe button so that you can be notified of all my future uploads along with that little notification bell. As you can see by the title today, we are doing a Getting Ready With Me, except for this one is going to be different than my previous Getting Ready With Me's. Today is going to be for all of the ladies out there, or gentlemen, I guess, um, that don't feel they have enough time in their morning schedule, daily schedule, to put on makeup. I used to be one of those people, believe it or not, and I can tell you that you can do it. So today, I am up for a challenge. We are going to do a 10 minute, that's right, you heard me right, 10 minutes I'm going to go ahead and take to do an entire face of makeup. Um, I'm going to go ahead and set my phone onto a timer, so this way here you can kind of keep track. And with the makeup that I'm going to be putting on today, everything that I have is from the local drugstore, Walmart, Target, Walgreens, whatever. So it is going to be inexpensive for your wallet. Um, in case you guys don't have any kind of a makeup routine, this is just for those people out there, again, that think that they can't they don't have any time to spare whatsoever in the morning to put on any kind of a beauty product. So I'm here to prove you guys wrong. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this video. So tie my hair back because I just, I don't care. And then we're going to go ahead and set the timer. timer. So I'm going to go ahead and set this for... 12 minutes and the 12 minutes is just to give me a couple of extra minutes to go ahead and talk through the steps but that's it so 12 minutes and start so I'm gonna go ahead and set this down here the first thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and prime our face um, I'm gonna go ahead and use just a three-in-one product Again, all of these products are going to be listed down in the description below. So this way here, if you guys have any questions on what products I am using, in case you haven't seen any of my previous videos where I actually go in depth about all of those, you'll be able to see them then. Um, let's go ahead and mute that computer off. Okay, next, I'm going to go in with my foundation. So I'm applying this right to my beauty blender. And then I'm going to pick up something that has a mirror in it. All right. And we are going to dab this all into our face. So obviously this whole, you know, 10 minute routine, this is not going to be anything super glam because anything of super glam like the um, eye tutorials that I do, those take just a little bit more time and technique to go ahead and do. However, you're only talking probably about maybe 10 minutes to do that eye look then. So, you do the eye look first, and then you've got maybe 5 or 10 minutes to go ahead and throw on your face. Not too bad. I mean, you could obviously spend an hour or so doing makeup and things, but not today. All right, so foundation is all on, concealer time. So concealer, just have one of these little Maybelline things, love these. So under eye, I like getting into all of my smile lines bringing that across. I'm going to do my eyes too while I'm at it. So here this can be, act as my primer. Bring that out. Get into all of those lines. Kind of across here. And then I also put it on my scarf. Same beauty blender. <laughs> and we're just going to punch that in. 
The other thing too is you want to go ahead and get products that blend out very easily. This way here you're not spending tons of time blending stuff out because that by itself obviously is going to take time out of your application. Now everything that I'm showing you in my opinion blends out very nicely like it doesn't take a lot of time to blend something into the skin and put it all there. So that's that. Get these out of our way. Face is good. I'm going to go ahead and set everything. I just have this e.l.f. setting powder. Oop, that's the um, mm -mm. I always put highlighter all over my face. So, get some of this. This is like a tinted um, setting powder. Only because again, I wanted to use anything from the drugstore that I have and the translucent powder that I normally use obviously you're not going to find at a drugstore. Okay. Looks good to me. Okay. It's all good. Alright. Next, we are going to go ahead and pop on our bronzer. And I'm also going to go ahead and use this bronzer as my one of my eyeshadows. So you get kind of like a two for one. And this also will save you time with getting your makeup done. So this way here you're not going into a million different products in the morning. Especially if you're not going to do anything glam. I mean, it's just nice to have a multifaceted product. Okay, how's that looking? For you guys, it looks great. So, now I'm going to go ahead and pop this on. Brush. Okay. So, I'm going to grab a little bit of this. Tap off any excess. This is going to be my crease. And we're just going to fill this out. Just like that. See that? Okay, now we're going to go into the other one. Same thing. This will just give you that pop of color that you're looking for. And honestly, this can be your everyday look. Nice, neutral. And you just, I mean, you can't go really wrong with any of this. Um, okay, so then our next thing we're going to go into is our blush. So blush, go ahead and apply this there. And here. And then the same thing, we're going to take this blush and we're going to go ahead and apply that to our lid everywhere on our lid. As soon as I can find, I think the biggest problem I'm having right now is finding my brushes. Okay, whatever. We'll just use the same one. Okay, so bring this one over the whole lid. Like so. Perfect. Alright, and then we're going to jump into our highlighter, and then the highlight, we're also going to go ahead and use this to highlight our eyes. So, bring this up, and bring this up here, pop it. Alright, get some of this highlight. I'm going to put it right into the corner of my eye, 
help brighten those. Perfect. And then we're going to come right up here to our brown bone. Right like that. Yes. And then I'm also going to go ahead and take this highlighter. I'm going to bring it down my nose. Pop it right there. And do the cupid's bow. Okay. Now, moving on. The next thing we're going to go ahead and do is we are going to go in with our mascara. Perfect. And we're going to do our under eye. is done and then a quick brow just to kind of fill in any spot this is optional you don't have to obviously do this you have nice full brows congratulations but mine are pretty full I am just kind of making them a little bit more prominent and take our spoolie in. Perfect. Okay. Next one. Oh my god, that air feels so good. I don't know about you guys, but the weather here in Jersey has just been crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. One day it's hot, humid. The next day you feel like you're back in spring. Okay. So, there is our eyebrows. They look fantastic, right? And then, last but not least, all we have left is our lips. Wow, see that? And, not a big fan of this lip pencil. I think it's a little bit too bright for this look, but... There's that. And then, set your makeup, ladies. Same spray. Did I forget anything? I don't think so. And we have one minute and 14 seconds left to spare. So, you can always go in and give yourself any kind of a touch-up. Um, you could, <laughs> mm. I don't know, I kind of, I think I got everything, actually. So, ladies, 10 minutes, that's it. 10 minutes, you achieve a nice look, put together, hell, even if you don't do makeup every single day, but just once in a while, you want to go ahead and throw on something just to give yourself a little bit of more oomph maybe for the office or you're going on a date but you don't really want to do like big extreme here's your way of doing nothing big extreme 10 minutes you're done you can walk out that door and look fabulous not that you don't already but you know so i hope you guys really like this video um as quick as it was 10 minutes getting ready with me <laughs> Um, if you have any tips, tricks, suggestions, comments, anything whatsoever, please leave those down in the, in the comment section below. I was going to say description, but, um, yeah, leave those down in the comments below. I'd be more than happy to go ahead and hear from you guys. Um, again, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. I'd love for you to become part of my small little family of followers. And I hope you guys have a wonderful Friday and a great weekend. We'll see you later.